in kind early. That was a shot that hung on the rim for quite a while for Darcy Garcia. And we've got a foul the other way. Just doesn't uh, work as hard. Clutch from Kane, unable to convert off of the offensive rebound. This has been a 7 nothing run for Marquette. Hook night ends that. Off the bounce. See, it just looks down low. Biggie's basketball. Carlton stays with it against Jackson. But he was looking for a whistle, didn't get it. Gaffney brings it down the floor. Gives it up to Booknight. Oh, how about the hang time? Booknight keeping it hot. It was a beautiful, beautiful maneuver. Theo John got a piece of this. They're calling a, a goaltend, which yep. is the right call. But he just doesn't wait. You know, if you would have to know, if you're not up in the passing lane in between, you got to back off because he gets a full head of steam going. Well, it's I, too late. I thought before, it was before that bucket. Huskies were ready to blow him out of the building. That's 6'11", stepping out. Nice touch. Hook Knight with a jab step maneuver. Drills it. Think about it. <laughs> There's the pop out. Carlton with the dribble handoff to Book Knight. Actually, just a simple handoff. There he is. That's a nice little hand lift job, right? Well, with Lewis back out there along with Theo John and the foul difficulty we mentioned, and no Carlton. It'll be interesting to see if Marquette goes inside when they have the ball. Teardrop bank is open late and on Saturday Absolutely scorching the net the Lead is a baker's dozen with just under 12 to play Book night off the curl So plenty of time for Marquette and it's right there for Sonogo. He was hesitant. And Buck Knight tipped it back. It's a team like UConn long and they have some talent. It's a, it's a recipe for a long afternoon. You see those three Connecticut players with four fouls. One of them, Sonogo, their long, big remains. Oh, and rattling at home is Buck Knight. It may not make a difference. <laughs> I will say when Coach Calhoun did television, people understood what I meant when I said, you couldn't understand what he was saying. Like, what do you mean? It's just that clean cut because he, he, he would always remind me. Huh? I don't know, Gus. Well, <laughs> thanks to Steve, I was a worthy candidate the following year. Oh, yeah. Yeah. I just want to hear as a player. You want to hear, all right, Biggie's tournament. We got two. Full court pressure. Quickly up to book.